I'm doing a series of series over on my TikTok. Sort of like a roll for himbo situation. And the first himbo up is Miss Frizzle or Mr. Frizzle. So let's get started. So I feel like Mr. Frizzle is just gonna be like an unhinged teacher dude, you know what I mean? Prepping my skin with this, because it's amazing. Makes my face super sticky, which is nice. A little ASMR. <laughs> Fabulous. I'm a little extra just unhinged today. We'll see how this goes. And I like to use a brush, because for some reason, the this foundation just looks better when I apply it with a brush as opposed to a sponge. Contour time. So she's got like a very iconic nose, so I have to like contour it a little bit differently than I would normally. I feel like it's a little bit bigger here. So we're gonna do a little scoop. Yeah, you see how it gives that like the different sort of nose shape? That's what we want. Keep it really low down here. Oh, I love it. If I do a nose contour and I don't contour around here, it just looks weird to me. So no matter what contour I do, I always contour right there. I feel like I've said this before, but there's things that I contour, not because they necessarily need to be contoured, but just because it helps with the like overall illusion if that part is also contoured. We move on to the deepening. Now I'm going to do like a little bit more defined around the shape that I made. Just a little bit. Just kind of blend it out into that softer color. Then it kind of does the blending for you. That's an O's, baby. <laughs> it's time for highlight which is honestly my, my, my favorite part just because it transforms everything so much We go into layer two of highlight. And then this highlight I'm gonna keep on the highest points of everything. Okay, so it's time for facial hair. And I initially wanted to do like a goatee but I think I just want to do like a swirly mustache. I feel like Miss Frizzle as a man would have a curly mustache. You know, I feel like I just, I feel that in my bones. Let's get a little closer. I like to do the first section of the brow for each of them and then move on to the rest because it makes it easy to match them. And usually I have like gaps and stuff, so it makes it easy 
to keep track of where I'm going because sometimes it gets out of hand. Looks really harsh right now, but oh, actually, am I gonna keep it like that? Maybe. Maybe. Just like a little mischievous, a lot of mischievous. I feel like they're. She's pretty mischievous. I also feel like she'd go by she they pronouns. That's that's a she they I think. <laughs> so I'm gonna do it all in orange and then I'm gonna go back in to the very end and do a little bit of red to the very front and do a little bit of yellow to give it like some dimension. Let's look. Ooh. I just spilled my paint water all over myself. Oh my god, it was really cold. Okay, hold on. Back with dry pants. I feel like I'm gonna be fiddling with this for too long for what it is, you know what I mean? Like, it's just an eyebrow. It's getting a little guy fieri, but we're, it's fine. <laughs> we're gonna do orange lashes to match the wig. So whenever I do colored lashes, I just do a like white or really light um, primer. That way I still get like the lengthening and the volume of mascara, but it's colored. So I just do this and then I'll go on top with eyeshadow. It's gonna look a little crazy. Before I go into the other one, while it's still a little wet, I'm gonna go in with that orange and just color it in. Literally just stamp it in. See? Nice and orange, but full still. I forgot the mustache. Let's do that now. <laughs> I want like a very whimsical. This frizzle is whimsical as hell. Yeah. Um, I think I want to do like a little bit of orange five o'clock shadow. Is that spicy or what? Sometimes you gotta do like a little sample. See if you like it. Mm, yeah, I like it. <laughs> I like it. So that was a little unhinged, wasn't it? It's genuine excitement, you know? It works. So I feel like a wacky science teacher would have five o'clock shadow, you know? Yeah. Yeah. I'm a little stubble. Cool. I think it's time to get dressed. Well, thanks for hanging out. Thanks for being here. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. Um, I hope it was educational a little bit. Um, but yeah, follow me on TikTok, Instagram, here, Twitter, but I hate Twitter. Um, anyway, thanks for being here. Mwah.